guys, welcome to So Fashion Basic again. I'm Catherine. So today I'm going to do a requested video, which is my handbag collection. Because I am cleaning up my closet right now, so I am making decision on what to maintain, what to sell or donate, and maybe add something new to my closet. I just cleaned out my handbags, it's right there in front of me, so I really feel like this is the best time to do a handbag collection. Let's go quick into it because there's a lot to show, and I will talk to you next time. For those bags that I use to work, the first one is this orange color Balenciaga day bag. The hobo style and the size of the bag is perfect for work days, and the orange color can bright up a long working day. I really like the mirror option of this bag. I can keep myself pretty at work. Another work bag of mine is this Balenciaga work bag in black color. The size is great for documents. And I guess it's made for work. That's why they call it work bag. Same here. All Balenciaga bags come with a mirror. Another bag for work. This Stella McCartney chain bag is very great for a classic work outfit. Sometimes I change it to a clutch after work. In the summer, sometimes I will wear this back to work. This case bay tote Great for document size as well, and it just brightens up your whole summer. If sometimes I'm wearing suits, smaller bag would be more appropriate. Here, this comes my smaller bag, this Chanel reissue bag in silver color. Very versatile. Back to school. So my school bags are very fun. This one is a satchel. Everyone needs a satchel for school because satchel are just made for school. And this one is a vintage satchel. Washable toes are the must-have for schools because sometimes you can only put your bag on the ground. You don't want your leather bags to get dirty and then you can't wash it. So this one I have a banana Taipei bag and a gift tote from Tory Burch. When you are doing all those projects, you need a big bag to fit your thick books and your laptop. And here it comes my Louis Vuitton Never Full Bag in GM size. Always big enough. Currently for school, I'm using this Philip Lim bag because I think the khaki color matches up my school outfit really well. This bag's leather is super sturdy for my books and laptops and also it has expandable zippers if I have too many books to bring to school. I don't know about you guys but sometimes it just gets really lazy. I don't want to dress myself up so I just wrap up a sweater and pick up my really easy going bag like the Louis Vuitton Speedy. In my lazy days, I'll wear this bucket bag with the tribal color black and white can give me a little bit complexity in my lazy days. Or I'll go with a vintage bag to enjoy the California sunshine. In my really 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 lazy days, I'll wear no bags but a wristlet with my keys, my phone, and some cash. My Mark by Mark Jacobs wristlet can let my shoulders free. I prefer fun bags or cute bags for day outs, like this Rebecca Minkoff white morning after bag. The tassel and studded details gives you more edge all the time. 
On my casual day out, sometimes I'll wear this vintage Chanel bag. It's so arty and classy. However, I don't wear that very often because the delicate texture. If I want to create model of duty or street styles, go with this Alexander Wan bag. Those studs are just stunning. I got this mango faux fur bag last year and I love them, especially in the winter. I wear it all the time. If I want to make a statement in the crowd, I'll go with this neon yellow Cambridge satchel. My black shirt is boring, but the yellow bag is interesting. Then I become interesting. If I'm going to the flea market, I'll carry this vintage bag with me. The pony hair is super soft and I can think something with history with this bag. If you guys know me, when I'm running errands, I like to dress up with leather jackets to be tough and easygoing. So I like this PS1 bag from Proenza Scholar. It just gives me that touch. When I want a slouchy black bag to go with a longer jacket, I'll go with this Shivanshi Nightingale bag. Really want to mention that this bag's shoulder strap is super soft, very comfy. My only structured large bag is this Celine Phantom luggage. I like how it can be a little slouchy with the side out and with the side in to be more structured. Now let's talk about my bags for night out days. If it's a fun night out, I prefer a clutch. This reversible clutch with two colors is the super interesting item that I own. Then it's little black bags, little black clutches. I have a patent bag and a lace bag. This little patent night west bag was from my high school. I kept this bag because I feel like it can be a good clutch. This Jason Wu for Target lace bag is a wristlet slash clutch. It's super spacious. I like it and I use it a lot. This box clutch is my newest addition to my nettle bags. It's a gift with purchase from Sephora. I love it because it has chains, you can cross over your shoulder or just wear it on your shoulder. If it's more like a formal night out, I'll wear my little Chanel bag. I know all my night out bags are in black color. And this vintage Chanel camera bag in beige color, I use it as a night out bag because of the short chain. And to add more colors. When it comes to travel, I carry really light bags. So this Balenciaga city bag, it's very lightweighted and soft leather. Really nice and spacious. Oh yeah, the mirror again. Keep you pretty while you're on the plane. This beige Shivanchi Pandora bag is another lightweighted bag and it has a cross shoulder traps, allows me to wear cross shoulder or on my shoulder. And the zippers are very easy when you are going to travel as well. And yes, I always have a little cross shoulder bags with me on my trips because I can shop hands free and the zipper is secure for this interwoven bag from Charlotte Russe and the snap closure is easy for my other leather bag from Latico. If my travel outfit has really dark colors, I'll take a color bag with me. And also this bag lightweighted cross shoulder straps or shoulder straps. Wear it both ways to match up my style. 
Again, if during that trip I prefer to go tougher, I'll bring this Alexander Wen Donna Hobo because it just matches with my leather jacket. I love leather jackets. Super soft leather and a lot of pockets for your cards or anything. I said it's for travel and trips. Of course, you need carry-alls, bigger bags. So I have this Michael Kors gift with perfume bag for me, and another Longchamp bag for me. So I carry them together when I'm going to trips, and they are very lightweighted, foldable, easy to pack in your luggage. So that's my current handbag collection. Click into my other videos if you can't get enough from this handbag videos because I have more, and I also have some styling videos. Subscribe to my channel, and I'll talk to you next time. Bye.